Good evening and welcome to the 2016 NCAA Division II Women's Volleyball Championship and the post-match press conference from our first semifinal match. We are joined by the Seawolves of Alaska Anchorage, who were victorious in tonight's opening semifinal. With the win, the Seawolves moved to 34-2 on the season and advanced to tomorrow night's national championship, where they will face the winner of our next semifinal between Concordia University and Lewis University. It will be the program's first trip to the national championship game. With us tonight are Coach Chris Green, senior setter Morgan Ho, and sophomore outside hitter Crystal and Johnson. We'll start with an opening statement from Coach Green and then open it up for questions. Uh, you know, we're uh, super excited. Uh, I don't know if I can say words that express, uh, you know, our thoughts right now, but uh, we're excited to uh, be advancing to tomorrow's match. And, uh, you know, we feel that uh, we competed well tonight. And if we play like we did tonight, uh, especially in the third game, I think we uh, will compete well against, uh, against anyone in, in the country. Uh, Maury, just to start with you for a second. Um, I know you, you, know, you talked back home that um, you, know, you come here and play UAA and compete for national championships. Now you're, you know, you're talking the talk, walking the walk. So you know, what's this like? <laughs> uh, like Coach said, I, don't, <clears throat> I can't really put it into words right now, obviously, because I can't talk. Um, <laughs> But we'd always talk about like serving for a regional championship. And this year we kind of changed to serving for a national championship. And then I had to go back and serve for a national championship semifinal. Um, so I think being able to train for one and to be here now is pretty exciting. Uh, in that final match where you guys won uh, late in the game, got kind of tense. You know, they started making a big run. What was it kind of like to pull the team together and, and make that final push to win it all? You know, I just knew we just need, we needed to relax. And as soon as we started to relax, then that point fell on the other side. Coach, it looked like a completely different team to open up the tonight versus yesterday. Did you do something differently tonight or just play better? Yeah, we uh, had a good warm up, actually. I think our warm up last yesterday wasn't so so good. And we had a great warm up. Uh, and we came ready to go. We knew that we needed to step out and play a lot better than we did the, in the first set yesterday. Coach, it seems like it's one signature win after the next. Uh, how would you kind of classify this season, this run, and, and to actually be here? You know, when you started the season, I'm, I'm sure, you know, this is the goal. What's it like to actually, you know, it's no, no, no more conference <coughs> stuff. Now it's national, you know, this is, this is pretty big here. Yeah, yeah, it is. I, 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 we're excited. I mean, I'm very proud of these girls. And we've, uh, shoot, uh, you know, we've had some, some tense uh, times where we, we had to score the next point. And that was way back against Northwest Nazarene. And... So they fought through a lot of adversity, and uh, again tonight, maybe that second game where Palm Beach came out on fire, uh, we fought back. You know, we pushed back and did a great job. And in the third, I thought the third game was some of the best volleyball we played as a Sea Wolf team, and that's what we want. We want that at the end of the year, and I, I think I saw that. I think I saw the very best that we've played so far, uh, especially in that third set. I guess what's going to take to keep that going for just one more year. Uh, you know, we'll, we'll get some food in these guys and sleep and uh, get them ready to go tomorrow. Um, Morgan, for you, has it hit you that tomorrow, you know, this is it for you, being a senior, that this is the, you know, it might not be volleyball after for you, actually. No, but thank you for reminding me. <laughs> <laughs> but no, it hasn't really, I don't think it's hit anybody that we're in the national finals tomorrow and definitely hasn't hit me yet that it'll be my last match. CK, um, talk about, you know, you started off well and then Uh, well, my team just told me that they had my back. They were going to cover me, so if I hit as hard as I did and it goes straight down, they'd be there to pick it up. So I trusted them, and I just trusted my setter, and I knew I needed to get the ball over the block. Uh, Coach Green, it seems like you guys like playing a role of spoiler, right? You upset yesterday, you upset again today. Um, so now with this match here, you know, obviously, <coughs> Paul, they have a pretty good history of winning this thing. Um, Who would you rather see tomorrow? <laughs> Uh, you had you, you asked me the same question yesterday. Um, well, you know, obviously we, we want the number one C. We, you know, it, it does, to us, we just want to get out there and play another another match. We'd like to just go keep going right now. Um, you know, we're like like I said yesterday, we're a, we're a fan of the underdog. So uh, I guess that gives you your answer. 
Coach, your thoughts on the line call at 2322? <laughs> um, Be careful, Coach. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, though. Yeah, I just I thought it was out. Uh, Crystal, yeah. tell me what it's like to play with Morgan. Oh my goodness. <laughs> well, what you say? Okay. <laughs> <clears throat> well, she. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, no, I love the seniors, Morgan and Aaron. I'm going to miss them next year. I don't want to cry, but um, I definitely enjoyed playing with them this year, and they're going to be missed most definitely. Morgan, you have a chance to end your career tomorrow night hosting a national championship trophy. What would that mean to you? I think I'll cry a yeah. lot. I don't mean I mean everything, especially coming from Alaska, being born and raised in Anchorage. You aren't seen as a good volleyball player. You, I don't think you ever will be. And maybe after our trip here, we will be. But you know, going out of to like national tournaments like the volleyball festival, we were always seen as the underdogs, and they were always look, oh, overlooked us. So I guess that's our advantage right now is that we're going to be overlooked, and that's when we can come in and strike. Congratulations to the Seawolves. We'll see you in the national championship game tomorrow night. Thank you. <coughs>